Yeah, well, Goss, it's been an incredible transformation for the Sydney Kings from cellar dwellers to championship contenders, and it's all due to this man here, Andrew Gaze. You're making this coaching caper look simple. <laughs> no, absolutely not. It's got uh, very little to do with me. We've got some good, talented players out there, and, and so far they've been playing really well, but probably most importantly that they're buying into the system and making sure that they uh, they understand their roles and in many cases sacrificing what they potentially could do in other um, in other structures. So it's it's been good so far, but a long, long, long way to go. Trevor Gleeson uh, dubbed you the rock stars of the NBL. Are you keen to put on a bit of noise here inside the arena? Yeah, it's, it's interesting. Uh, every, a lot of people are trying to keen to, to, to pump us up and perhaps take a little bit of pressure off themselves, but but that's okay. We, we accept that. Uh, ultimately, you know, Perth are the team to beat because they're the defending champions and been in the playoffs as long as I can remember. So it's a big, big test for us. And again, if you're going to win a title, you've got to go through Perth. So it's going to be a huge challenge playing two games in a relatively short period of time. So we're looking forward to it because it, I think it'll give us a good gauge of, of where we're at and what we need to do to compete against a, a mighty team like Perth. Perth, very undermanned, aren't they? No Damien Martin, Jared and Kenny yeah, will no. be... <laughs> they very are undermanned. very undermanned, uh, oh, oh. Andrew. A lot, of teams be, a lot of teams would love to be as undermanned as what they are right now. They've got enormous talent, so don't get conned by that. Come on, mate. <laughs> Kevin Lish, uh, a chance for him to unleash. No point guards, really, for Perth in this game. Uh, is he keen to put on a show in front of his old fans? Well, he's playing really well, and um, our guard rotation has, has been good. It, it, we're scoring a lot of points... Uh, uh, from that particular position, but it's going to be interesting tonight because uh, the matchups are going to be that both our guys are going to have to deal with size, and what happens down the other end of the floor is going to be a big challenge as well. We suspect that they're going to look to post our guys up, but uh, hopefully we've got enough help coming from elsewhere to, to try and deal with that. But um, but no, Kevin Kevin's been fantastic. He's a superstar. You know firsthand how good he is. And uh, last week he was phenomenal, hitting a game winner and uh, 30 points, I think it was, against Melbourne United. He's a He's a high-class uh, player that uh, we wrapped that he's in a Sydney Kings uniform. There's certainly something about this team. I like watching you on the sidelines, but I'm really enjoying the post-game celebrations when you get a win. Uh, would you dare do this on the centre of the court at the end of the game if you get the win <laughs> tonight? Absolutely zero chance of that happening, uh, Loggy. No, we, it's, it's something that I wasn't aware of, uh, mainly because we didn't see it too much last year because they didn't won too much. Uh, they only won six games last year, but apparently they were doing it last year. It was, it was new to me, but, but I love it. I think we see, see it in a lot of other sports here in Australia. It's very much part of our culture that when you have a win, you go in and enjoy it. And, uh, you know, my mantra this, this uh, time with the, the Sydney Kings has been all about just having fun and enjoying uh, each other's company and making sure that we develop the brotherhood. And, um, you know, I think that that goes, it's all part of it. Well, remember one thing, Andrew. The kings of the jungle here wear red. Okay. <laughs> well, we've lost the last eight games by 22 plus, so we are rank outsiders here, extreme underdogs, and looking to fight against this massive red army here. See if we can't get a win. To quote Andrew Gaze, turn it up. Tim, back to you. <laughs>